Hi guys, Thomas Tinkenton76 here, and today I'm going to be doing a discussion on Scruffy. So let's get started. Now, Scruffy has to be one of the best piece of rolling stock they've ever made in the Thomas Wooden Railway line. This is the Scruffy that they made back in the 90s, and uh, it's a really neat looking item. Unfortunately, there was never a name at the bottom until they reintroduced the line, which I will reveal this on the reintroduced wooden scruffy. And I really like that face. It makes me think of the TV show and the black wheels. Well, I don't know why they added the black wheels, but they added the correct orange wheels on his reintroduced model. And it's a pretty good looking model. I'm pretty sure in the TV series that it had this orange. I have no idea if it ever contained that, but I did watch the episode Toad Stands By, and Scruffy was featured in the episode, and in the episode Put Upon Percy, there was a truck that had a face resembling Scruffy's, well, actually, the truck had Scruffy's face, and so I was a bit surprised that they actually added that, so, yeah. They did a really good job with this old style model, and I really like this one. I also like the one you see to the right. So let's get started with the other one. The reintroduced model has got to be one of the best scruffy models they made. I mean, it's a pretty good looking model. I like the one you see on the left, but I also like this one because of the ooh, face. I really like that one, and... Uh, I like the details, and I also like that they added the name at the bottom. Back then, Wooden Railway never did this. Back in the 90s, Wooden Railway never even did this. Instead, we only got models lacking the names at the bottom, so you couldn't tell who this character was. But, back then, they actually remembered to add that, and I really like that. Oh, and also it comes with a removable load, so it can stay there and be removed, and you can take it out if you want to. And I think it personally looks better with the ballast load, so let's put that back in. And I really like how they did with this model. It looks really awesome. Anyway, I, I don't understand why they had to make the loads magnetic. I mean, I don't know why they made these magnetic, but it's alright in my opinion. So... That's my discussion on Scruffy. Bye!